Okay, so our books had the opportunity just to settle overnight after a lot of work was done on them yesterday. Um, let's have a look at them. So this one actually had a reasonable amount of uh, work done to it uh, in terms of gluing down the end papers themselves. So this one is still a little damp, so uh, it's a little darker in places. So what I'm gonna do is just give the opportunity for the this paper here, the uh, kitchen roll paper, just to stay, stay in situ and just help, help this just to um, dry out a little bit further. I'm just gonna fold it slightly for reasons that I'll share in a moment. So this is a, in effect, this book's 24 hours behind the others in terms of just um, drying out and so on. So uh, let me just go fold out like that. Okay. So that's that one. We need to do a little bit of a repair just there as well. This volume, that's dried out nicely, as you can see. That's what we're after. Um, a really nice dry finish. Just open there. The same paper is just a little bit stiff. There we go. These can come out now. That's nice and dry. This volume 35. That's quite stiff there. pages that were separated have been put back, glued in place. This whole, these whole group of pages here were separated and loose. They're now glued back. That's drying out nicely. Okay. Why don't we have a look at how these look on the shelf. So here we have it folks. After all the work we've done, Historic Ecclesiastique, complete in 36 volumes, including the four volumes here that we've done all the work on. As previously mentioned, you can tell these are from a different set. Just slight differences in coloration of the labels, the leather. Um, but nevertheless, there we go. That was our target, and I think it's turned out pretty well. 